Imagine bare feet skipping through sun-dappled Texas woods, laughter echoing off the weathered clapboards of a farmhouse. For young Joanna, faith wasn't just fancy Sundays, it was the aroma of cinnamon rolls wafting through the air, the hushed prayers around worn furniture, and the helping hand extended to neighbors in need. Dreams like climbing vines clung to every crooked windowpane and rusty hinge, whispering of homes not just built of bricks, but filled with stories waiting to be told. College took Joanna to New York City's dazzling lights, but the city's rhythm couldn't hold her love for sun-drenched porches and star-studded skies. So she returned to Waco, where fate, with a twinkle in its eye, introduced her to Chip Gaines, a man with calloused hands and a toolbox overflowing with dreams. Their love story wasn't scripted for a romance novel. It was built in a dusty workshop, where Joanna's artistic vision met Chip's construction magic. They started small, transforming forgotten houses, not just fixing walls, but fixing hope, one family at a time. Every nail hammered, every brush stroke wasn't just about reshaping wood and plaster, it was about breathing life back into forgotten dreams, one porch swing at a time. Fame, they chased purpose, their faith guiding their every decision. They proved that beauty could bloom even in the most cracked foundations, and their People Over Projects motto resonated with viewers who found more than just design inspiration in their work. They saw a reminder that home wasn't just four walls, but a haven built on love, laughter, and shared Sunday dinners. On shows like Fixer Upper, Joanna wasn't just a designer, she was a storyteller, weaving narratives of transformation not just on screen, but in the hearts of those watching. Her signature style, a blend of modern farmhouse and vintage charm, became more than aesthetics, it became a symbol of comfort, family, and simpler times. Remember the time she transformed a grandma's cramped kitchen into a sun-drenched haven, tears of joy sparkling in her eyes as she saw the delight on the family's faces? That was Joanna's magic, not just in the shiplap and vintage finds, but in the way she brought people together, creating spaces filled with love and laughter. Their impact wasn't limited to TV screens. Joanna's best-selling books, brimming with design tips and heartwarming stories, became cherished companions for readers seeking a touch of her magic in their own homes. But God had a funny way of bringing me Chip to almost have this reality of what it's like to follow Christ, which is a lot of the things are gonna push you to a place of discomfort. Her home decor line, filled with pieces that reflected her love for natural textures and handcrafted details, brought a slice of her world into homes across the country. And who could forget Magnolia Market at the Silos? More than just a shopping destination, it became a pilgrimage site for fans, drawn by the scent of fresh baked cookies and the warm community spirit Joanna fostered. Silo's Reading Foundation, born from her passion for literacy, helped children discover the joy of books, while her unwavering support for local businesses and charitable causes showed the true meaning of her faith in action. Joanna's journey wasn't a fairy tale, but a testament to the power of faith, hard work, and a generous spirit. Set it apart. It, it was no longer Chip and Joe were doing a business. It was, this is God's thing. Magnolia is God. She didn't just renovate houses, she renovated lives, reminding us that beauty can be found in unexpected places, and that true purpose lies in building communities, not just walls. Remember that verse from Colossians, Work hard at everything you do, as working for the Lord, not for human masters, knowing that you will receive an inheritance from the Lord as a reward. It is the Lord Christ you are serving. Like Joanna, let's work with faith in our hearts, knowing that even the smallest act of kindness and creativity can inspire the world around us. Go forth, find your own sunlit dreams, and build your own house of hope and purpose. In the grand design of life, even a flicker of faith, paired with a smile and a helping hand, can create a masterpiece of joy and touch the lives of those around you. Did Joanna's journey make your heart soar? Mine did too. Remember, your own shiplap dreams are waiting to be built. Share this spark of inspiration, hit that like button, and don't forget to click the subscribe bell for more stories of faith, resilience, and making the world a brighter place. This channel is a treasure trove of hidden gems, from everyday heroes to inspiring journeys like Joanna's. Keep searching, keep believing, and keep the conversation going. Until next time, stay joyful, stay hopeful, and remember, even the smallest act of kindness can be the first brushstroke on your own masterpiece. 
See you again soon.